everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Kayla King. For those of you who are new, welcome. Please like and subscribe if you have not already. I would love to have you stick around if you enjoy my videos and would like to see more videos like this. Please let me know below in the comments if you enjoy these type of hauls. Now I would also like to say this video is not sponsored in any type of way. I do not receive any money. This is my real honest reviews on all of these products that I purchased with my own money. So let's jump right into the video. I'm going to show you one product that I purchased from Amazon and all of the products that I purchased from Ulta. So the first product is the one that I purchased from Amazon. Now they may have this on the Ulta website. To be honest, I did not look because I would already purchased it through Amazon. Um, but this is just put out by L'Oreal Paris. You can also purchase this at Walmart if you do not shop on Amazon. Um, but this is the L'Oreal Paris in the shade 416 I Create. I really like this lipstick because it seems to last as I drink my coffee and water and stuff throughout the day. It seems to stay on my lips really good. It's a matte color and it also seems to be really good with my skin tone. So I, I've really been enjoying wearing this lipstick. I've had it for a couple days now. Um, the next products that I show you are all from Ulta. And I switched foundations because the foundation that I was wearing I felt like did not give me really good full coverage and I have a lot of redness on my face. So keep that in mind with this foundation. I feel like it's really helped conceal the redness in my skin tones. I'm usually red through here and a little bit on my forehead. So if I don't have foundation on you can really tell. So this is the Smashbox. And I really like this shade. Um, this is the 1.1 Fair Light Neutral by Smashbox and I think it's really good. It was really affordable foundation as well. I don't remember exactly how much it was, but it was not too expensive and I got it when it was on sale. So that was another plus, but I think it's done really good. Like it really matches well with my skin tone and all the makeup that I'm going to show you I'm wearing. The only thing that I'm not going to show you that I do have on my face is my eyeliner and I purchased it at TJ Maxx. I want to say the brand is pronounced Pacifica, not 100% on if I'm saying that correctly, so don't hold me to it, but it's a white eyeliner, um, and it's it's black, but the, the cover is white, so it's a, a crayon. So I really like it. I've been using it for a while, and I think I paid like maybe $7 for it at, at TJ Maxx. Their makeup is normally pretty affordable, and you can purchase it, I believe, at Ulta and Amazon as well. So if you're looking for that eyeliner, I think you can purchase it at both of those places. Also have on the Tarte concealer. Now my concealer, I put my foundation completely on my face first, and then I put the concealer here, blended it in with a beauty sponge, as well as on top of my nose, a little bit on my forehead and on my chin right here. And then I just kind of blended that all through. Once I did that, I added the contour. So for my contour, I purchased the Cali contour and it's really, really pretty shades in this contour. So I have all of them on. I started with these two, then I went to these two, and then last I used that as the highlighter. So I have that here across my forehead, on my chin, as well as my nose. So I just kind of blended my entire face with that. The eyeshadow that I have on is put out by Morphe. This is the Truth or Bear by Morphe. Look how beautiful the eyeshadow palette is. Beautiful colors and they go on really good. I put these on with a brush. And I have this shade on my eyelids. So right here I have this shade and then this shade I have in my crease. That is the only two shades that I have, and I did blend it down a little bit up under my eye right here. Even though I still have eyeliner on, I still blended it. And then the last product that I purchased is the IT Mascara, and I really liked this mascara. I feel like it gave my eyelashes a lot of volume. And this is the Superhero elastic stretch volumizing mascara so i really like all of the products um if i was giving them like a five star review i think i would have to five star everything that i purchased from there it was really good purchase and i will be purchasing these items again in the future i'm sure because i really like them especially that foundation that foundation was really good and i really liked it now if you wanted to set it you could also um set the foundation with like 
the Tarte setting powder, the translucent one is really good. Um, and there's a couple other different ones, setting powders that you can get and use that would set your foundation a little bit more. And that may be something that I do in the future. But today I didn't do that. Um, today I just used the foundation. So I wanted to show you exactly what it looked like. And I really like it even without the powder on top of it. I really like it. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I also do videos um, showing different other makeup that I receive. I'm part of the Ipsy family, so I receive Ipsy um, bags. And I do have a link for that. I can leave the link down below if that's something that you're interested in. It's a subscription service and every month they send you five products, one of which you get to choose. And they're really nice products. So that's how I try out a lot of makeups before I go purchase the entire bottle like foundation or something like that now i have not tried this foundation this was the first time trying this so this was just real honest raw review on that one um but some of the other products like this concealer i've tried out before i purchased the full size that came in with my ipsy bags before so some things like that i have as well as this um, mascara that I purchased I have tried it in the past it came in one of the ipsy bags so I do have those videos if you would like to go back and watch some of the videos that I've received in the past it's a really good um, subscription service and I really enjoy getting those every month but thank you for watching and I hope to see you all soon